Hi class, I have a story for you. This one is titled, Firebird. He lived for the sunshine. It was written by Brent McCorkle and Amy Parker. I hope you enjoy this one as much as I do. Once upon a time, there lived a little baby Oriole named Firebird. His mama named him on account of his brilliantly beautiful orange feathers. This is a picture of his mama. This is a picture of Firebird. Firebird just lived for the sunshine. On those glorious sunny days, he would fly way up to the highest branch he could find, throw back his little head, and bask in the glow of the sun. But oh, when the rains came, little Firebird would whine and complain. Why, Mama? he asked. Why does God let the storm take the sun away? Mama would just smile and say, You'll know someday, baby. Then she'd get that faraway look as if she were looking straight up to the sun. You know, when you take a walk on the clouds. Now, over and over again, the rains would come, and over and over again, Firebird would complain to his mama. Until one day, a huge storm rolled in, and Mama had a different answer. Firebird, Mama said with a nod toward the clouds. The answer's up there, a-waiting for you, but you're going to have to fly up there and see it for yourself. Little Firebird was so scared, he hadn't used his wings much at all, and now they trembled at the sight of the storm clouds above. Still, he just had to find out for himself. He had to know why God let the storm take the sun away. So up, 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 he went up into the great unknown. But instead of answers, poor little Firebird only found thunder, lightning, and a fierce howling wind. He feared it would rip him apart. He was just about to turn back when it happened. Firebird broke through the clouds. And there it was in that one moment, it all became clear. Look at him up there. His family's down below where it's still raining and he went through the clouds. All alone in the mist, of the darkest storm, Firebird saw the sun shining more brightly than ever. And then he knew. God never let the storm take the sun away. It was as constant as his mother's love, waiting there just above the clouds. Little Firebird never forgot that moment, even after he was a big Firebird. He still loved to bask in the sunshine, but more importantly, knowing the sun was always there, Firebird had learned to rejoice in the rain. So boys and girls, just try to remember that when you're trying to deal with something that you just can't handle and you just can't figure out the answers to, just know that if you keep pushing on through the storms, there's still going to be some sun, and there's always someone who loves you. Jesus loves you. God loves you. And I love you, too. I hope you have a good day.